everyone. It's Nona Grace. Did you know, this is going to be a crazy, oh, where am I from? Yes, where? <laughs> I am from Western New York. Do you know where Western New York is? It's far, far, far away from New York City. So far that I've only been there once in my whole life, and it was on a bus trip. But I was going to tell you, this is a crazy video. It's um, about my life, about my day and chicken talk, or maybe rooster talk. Rooster talk. Hi, rooster talk, but I'm going to call it chicken talk, because he is a chicken. Yeah. I was just looking up, I knew, I was telling Jim that the rooster has a lot of different crows, and I wish I could understand the crow when he goes up onto the, onto the dog kennel to say, it's time to have snack, come girls, come get your snack. I wish I could understand that crow, because Every now and then I say, is he up on the dog panel? No, he's just out there crowing. But I was listening to how the people describe uh, rooster crows in different countries. Did you know that they crow different in different countries? Because they were asking people um, all over the world, mm -hmm. pretty much, how do the rooster crow in your, in your area? And a lot of people said in America, or the United States, they say cock a doodle doo. Well, they don't. Only in books do they say cock a doodle doo. <laughs> no, in cartoons. And in cartoons, they go cock a doodle doo. And no, that's not what they say. They go, ar, 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 is what they do say. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was some that were saying that they say coo coo coo. And they say kikiri ki or something like that. Mm -hmm. and, and I don't know what other sound they oh, made, I, but there it was so many. Uh, there was a lot that. of them, but the, none of them sounded like um, the roosters that I hear every day. And the one was complaining that the rooster would crow at 5 a.m. Well, our rooster rooster crows at four something. At three. At, at three. two. <laughs> he's he's just telling the world out there that he has. I'm in here, so don't you dare come in. You'll. You'll lose your life, or I'll fight till I lose mine, whichever comes first. And they will fight to, to protect the hens. They will protect them. Today, I have to tell you, I put little lady outside, and as soon as she got outside, she was okay for a little bit, but then who gives her trouble but Blackie? And I hear her squawking, and here's Blackie giving her a hard time, and the rooster ran over, and he stopped it. Then a little later, she was coming up towards the hen, the enclosed chicken house, and she was attacked again by Blackie. Blackie is so mean. She's the one that I used to have to put gloves on to just move her when she would get into the wrong, to check whether she had eggs under her or something. She was she was just mean. She was a very mean do dog, I was going to say. <laughs> she is like a dog. She bites. Um, some dogs don't bite the dog. There's depending on the dog. My my dog might bite. Never know. It's got a record. Did you know my dog has a record? Yes, it has a record. Oh, this is crazy. This reminds me of um, when I was watching Jan. I don't remember her channel name, but I will put the link into it. She was she was doing a thing about talent. I'm going to go all over the place today. This is going to be a really crazy. I told you it was going to be crazy. It's crazy. But anyways, Jan was talking about how she has no talent, and she was just going on and on about, you know, how the houses are out there, and, and or she wasn't talking that. I don't remember what she said, but it was, uh, this is, this is examples of, like, um, I was telling you about dogs. Dogs, did you know dogs bite? Some dogs bite. And then I went on to where my dog has a record. You know how my dog got a record? My dog was, was reported to, a bit a, it did bite. It but bit my granddaughter right on the lip, and she had to have stitches. So, oh, so when they take them in to have stitches, of course the dog is is reported that it was the dog that bit. And what happened is they had taken the dog to a cheering practice, which you don't do. You don't take this dog to a cheering practice. And he's all, a high strung little chihuahua. Yeah, and everybody thinks he's a puppy. He's not a puppy. He's a full grown old man. Well, anyways, he bit my granddaughter, and my granddaughter had to have stitches. So then the health department is involved, 
And then the health department calls me to find out if he's had his rabies shots, and yes, he has. And because he had them through the clinic, it was very easy for them to, t to check. And then I had to quarantine him for I don't know how many days to make sure that he was not around anybody, and he wasn't. And then they called to check and to see how he's doing. Oh, he's doing good. He hasn't been around anybody. So I tell the kids when they come, don't pet Jake. If Jake comes to you and wants to be petted, fine, but don't go after him because he gets he can't hear very well, I don't think, anymore. And who knows if his eyesight is good. I have to clap my hands, I don't know how many times, to get his attention. And sometimes he'll come and sometimes he won't. So I'll have to go get him and pick him up. Luckily, he doesn't snap at me. Although, when I've startled him, he's snapped. Mm -hmm. But he hasn't made contact. He stops himself. But... Yes, my dog has a record. <laughs> so he was on probation for a while, doggy probation. And we were talking about roosters and we ended up on dogs. But that's how it goes, you know, in my life. I could start on one thing and end up somewhere else. Well, and Blackie, oh no, yeah, Blackie was nasty, but little lady, she came to the gate. She, oh, I didn't finish the story on her. <laughs> oh, good heavens. She was she had she had been attacked twice by Blackie and the rooster intervened. Then the third time she was coming up she wanted to, she wants to come in the house when it's nighttime. She was coming up towards the uh, where everybody was at near the enclosed run and Blackie's staring at her so she stops. Blackie turns her back and so she walks a little faster and she came into where she was underneath oh, Jake, what are you doing up here? Oh my goodness. Somebody forgot to close the I door. I forgot to close the door and he came up. What do you want? You want up? You want to say hi to the people? You can come up. And he says, oh good, she's going to let me up. Mm -hmm. I never let him up because I don't want to get full of dog hair. Come here. I'll pick you up. Come here. Up. Now you come closer. Oh, you're heavy. Oh, this, there's Jake. Okay, now sit. 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 And look at the camera. Okay, <laughs> over here. If you're going to be in here, you got to look at the camera. <laughs> Say hello, world. I'm the dog with the with the. I'm the record. I'm the convict dog. Uh, yes, I am. <laughs> I have a I have a record. Um, well, anyway, she was coming up to the to the enclosed run, and when Blackie looked at her, she stood still. And then when Blackie turned away, she ran real quick and went around into the little um, chicken tractor that has no tarp on it now. It's just wire, chicken wire. And she got in there and she went into the corner and hid down. She put her head down and Blackie was like strutting over to go. And I stood there and I looked at Blackie and Blackie looked at me and then Blackie kind of turned away because I'm the top hen in this batch. Yep. And um, then Blackie decided that, you know, he's not going to tangle with me. She's not going to tangle with me. So she walked away and she went up the other way and then little lady comes around and she comes in front of the gate and she was pacing back and forth she wanted in you could tell she wanted in so and the rooster's watching all this he's watching blackie he's watching little lady he's watching me he's watching them all but he just stood there and he was he was and when i walked in he kind of backs away too because he says oh she's the top person or top she's the top one i'm the top i'm not a hen i'm a person but still, I'm the top. So I picked up little lady, and she's cool cooing as I'm carrying her in. And when I put her into her playpen, she gets to eat her lovely snack that I leave her. And she can have all that she wants and doesn't have to fight for it. So she's really liking the inside. I don't know. She's spoiled. She's spoiled. She is spoiled. <laughs> but, you know, until she's really ready to join them in the hen house, I'll just keep bringing her in. The only downside is I don't know what I'm going to do in the winter. This is going to be tough because she can't spend the whole day in the house. I was reading about how the temperature of the hens. Hens are about 110 degrees normally. That's why they're never cold. And like people think in the winter that they could be cold. No, they're not. It's like wearing a down coat all the time and just roasting. And so when they go broody, their temperature rises even more. And they um, are really warm. And then they, uh, I've got silver still in timeout. 
that silver has to she's gonna have to stay there all day tomorrow then I'll let her out on Wednesday in this way she should be over her broodiness because I don't want any baby chicks at this time of the year it's getting too cold and I'm supposed to take a motorcycle ride oh gosh <laughs> and get ice cream <laughs> yeah. blue bike and Doyle he tagged me and so I and so now it's uh, I, in fact, I googled to make sure the ice cream parlors are still open. I think there's one that's still open, so we will probably try to go there. But it's got to be a nice, warm, sunny day for me to go out on the motorcycle and for me to get ice cream, which is cold. So, and that's, I guess that's all I'm going to tell you and today. it's got to be a day we don't have the, the grandkids The grandkids, either. yeah, because I'm Cause getting the grandkids school. every day. So it's going to, it's kind of, it's kind of going to be tough. Might have to be a weekend. Hopefully a weekend Might is happen. nice. Yes. And so that's that's it. We're done. I'll let you go. Or I'm glad you stayed this long. <laughs> if you stayed this long. If you stayed this long, oh gosh, I used to give you something to give me. Give me, um What's my dog's name? Yeah. Put in there what my dog's name is and I'll give you a hint. I guess I'm all done again. I'm all mm. done. <laughs> yes. Um if you've stayed this long, then put my dog's name in, and I'll give you a hint. My dog's name rhymes with lake. How do you spell lake? <laughs> L-A-K-E, but it's the different letter <laughs> in the front. If you Sounds like. Sounds like, <laughs> yeah. It could sound like, um, what letter of the alphabet is that? It's also a boy's a, name. Yeah. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. Yep, it's the next one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll see you. Bye.